Oh good lord it feels nice to be back after this hectic journey Hey wait a minute why does this look green to me where is this green color coming from aha Penicillin is one of the biggest breakthroughs in the history of medicine that saved humankind from the dreadful diseases caused by bacterial infections. Penicillin proved to be the medication that increased the human life expectancy by 23 years. I was born in Scotland and I studied in St Mary's Hospital in London. and later i started teaching bacteriology sadly i had a notoriously disorganized lab but most of the interesting experiments of my life happened here when i returned to my lab after the two week long vacation i noticed something unusual I had inoculated several petri dishes with staphylococci before leaving for the vacation. I did not place them in an incubator because I knew that the staff would sufficiently multiply over time. I did not know that penicillium mold grows well in the room temperature. A former member of his lab was visiting Fleming the same day. Fleming took some of the contaminated cultures to show his visitor and that is when Fleming noticed an inhibition zone around the fungus as i observed closely this colony of mold was completely unexpected and clear of bacteria there is also a compound secretion that kills the bacteria this is a species of penicillium and we termed it as penicillium notatum eventually i noticed that this mold was constantly producing penicillin to protect itself from any outside threat many bacteria cell walls were also getting destroyed by penicillin These walls get their strength from a thick protective mesh of sugars and amino acids. They are constantly being broken down and rebuilt. Penicillin also releases highly reactive molecules that cause additional damage to the bacteria. With these constant attack by penicillin, the bacteria dies soon. It's not harmful to their own cells because they do not have cell walls. The first medicinal use of penicillium was demonstrated by Alexander Fleming's student, Dr. Cecil Payne. This demo was done on an eye of a patient suffering from severe pneumococcal infection. The patient's eye was saved. with crude pcm extract the death rate from pneumonia during the first world war in the us army was at 18% but during the second world war the death rate dropped to less than 1% by this time researchers had already figured out on how to isolate the active compound of penicillin and grow the mold in larger quantities With this success in 1945 Fleming got to know about his nomination for the Nobel Prize and the Nobel Committee bestowed the prestigious prize in physiology and medicine to Alexander Fleming Ernst Boris Chain and Sir Howard Walter Florey The discovery of penicillin in 1928 marked the golden age of natural antibiotic substances that took the medicine industry by storm